It is my last week of CrossFit. Not by choice though. You thought, you thought. No, it's because my gym is closing down and this is the last week that I get to show my appreciation and put in my all. It's my last week being at a gym, it doesn't mean that I'm gonna give up going to the gym or gonna give up losing weight. I've got my own equipment here and I've bought some equipment from the gym as well. And I'm going to do my best, my very best, to put it all together and to do what's here at home because CrossFit is great in the sense that you can do it anywhere and everywhere. You could be in the hospital and do a ward, you could be at the park and do a ward, you could be in a gym and do a ward. Like it's very, very, very good in that sense. Yeah, my gym unfortunately closed, but it doesn't mean that it's not gonna come back. I have hopes, I have hope that people will come back and we'll be able to put it together. I got permission from my coach uh, she gave me permission to record my last week of coaching at CrossFit and it was very sentimental because the last day that I coached was also how I started when I started CrossFit. I'm trying not to cry but when I started CrossFit I coached with her and my last word that I got to do I coached alongside her as well. I know I'm gonna miss the place. I know it's a great place to be at and I'm going to miss people definitely but I know I'm not going to not see anybody if that makes sense I'll see everybody around so happy tears guys because I know it's going to be a brighter future for my um, boss my um, coach my head coach it's going to be a brighter future for her and it's going to be a brighter future for us as coaches as well so happy days but anyway watch it Enjoy it. Try not to cry through it. And yeah. And don't forget, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like me, please subscribe. And yeah, don't worry. I got more stuff cooking. I just got to put it together. I haven't been lazy. I've just got a lot of things on my mind, okay? Okay, let's go. From you looking at my eyes, girl, you know what's in me Jingle bring the beat alive every time, you know uh, uh, uh. From you looking at my eyes, girl, you know what's in me Okay, well, 
Well, I'm going to start the time. It's only for, so you have to do three, then you get 30 seconds to look at the clock, yes? Yeah? So look at the clock when it's 30 seconds. And then five. Yeah, and then five. I just got a message from my new dude. Why you act question my blues? Clues. Have a good day. Enjoy your trip back. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
morning. It is the last 5 a.m. session. I haven't been doing 5 a.m.s for a while. I started, I'm pretty sure, in August, so like the last four or five months of 2023. But yeah, it's it's gonna be a sad one. I don't really like doing these things because I just cry the entire time and as soon as I see someone cry, I start tearing up, so I'm just like, <sighs> But tomorrow is my last day coaching at CrossFit Kalgoorlie. I have loved every bit of it, like the members, the staff, especially our boss. She's not a boss, she's a leader, let me tell you that. It's going to be very, very hard to not come in throughout next week or not be a part of the gym because this is my home. This is where my son's growing up as well. Three years we've been coming on and off and in three years he's gotten to learn and love the gym he's gotten to be here and interact with other people he's that so used to it that he knows when we get up in the morning we go to the gym straight away so yeah it's gonna be a hard one for sure okay i need to go inside i'm not as tired as i was yesterday yesterday kind of hit me real bad but today i'm feeling all right we should be okay Baby girls of wine. What is written up for the day? And now I write up the names of the people that are coming. And then we wait. Our clock is always wrong. It's never on time, so just gotta figure that out. But today's word is VT, which is just all barbells. And the two boys that I know that are coming today, they're very competitive and it's amazing to see. So yeah, have fun watching. Okay, normally I don't have time to do anything, so I shove it all in my bag and don't want to get hit. And now we wait. Sometimes I'm standing over at the board because I'm taking my time. It's the last one for 5 a.m. <laughs> Cross my heart, 
hope they die Stick a needle in my eye I can never trust a busy body that be picking sides You say you been put on since a young and I can see the line I know all your Come on, Link Your history, your grandmama was paying times Something better for you, baby She was a good time, but I need something everlasting Her favorite activity is spending time and sex with oh, How could I ever get past it? I can never feel like the daddy one, no Had to switch it Shawty got a blocky and they both come with extensions We both turned out different, but we still came from the trenches I can not lie Hope they die, stick a needle in my eye I can never trust a busy body that be picking sides Let's get started, it's just Hailey really that's talking Good morning, welcome I'm sure she will Welcome It's our last 6am Yay, yay, yay Thank you for coming Thanks for coming to join We have seven rounds Yes, yes, yes I want to I literally recorded everything this morning holding onto my camera only to realize that my tripod was in the freaking car. Anyway, it is the afternoon. I'm getting ready to go. I'm currently not dressed at all. I just finished decorating my lounge and cleaning it so that it's nice and tidy and get my son ready and myself ready so that we can go to the gym and have a good time. It's the last Friday, so I'm <laughs> I'm really gonna miss this place. Anywho, let's get to it. <laughs>
just yeah. by yourself. <laughs> and I lost it. <laughs> you did your own thing, eh? What? Did you do the cake by yourself? Yeah. <laughs> so now you gotta go over there. I just want you to jump and touch each of them. Yeah? One. You can jump that high. <laughs> Hundred meters. I'm confused because everybody's all over the place. That's it. That throw, man. <laughs>
yeah, I'm really, really disappointed and sorry that she's had to do this. Yeah. Um, I love being here. I think I came first in 2014 when it was over the other the side. And I've been coming and going for nearly nine years. So yeah, It's one of the places where I've always felt comfortable uh, exercising. All the people here have always been really great. All the coaches have had a good vibe about them. And yeah, it's been awesome, awesome time here. So really disappointed that um, I've decided to come back and now we're shutting down. <laughs> it's you, Matt. That's what it is. Yeah. It's all about, it's all about me. <laughs> Hey, I'm gonna miss you. Thank you for all the encouragement, all the you know, all the sharing of your food, healthy diets, and everything. And I love to come six o'clock class and see your beautiful face. I'm gonna miss that. We love you, Kay. <laughs> hey, there's not enough words to say how grateful I am to have been able to find CrossFit to come and get to the body that I have today. Sometimes the body's been different, sometimes it's been great, sometimes not so great, but regardless of how it looks, it's always been amazing to come in and have some great laughs and never complain and be very quiet and just do the workout. So thank you so very much for all your time and efforts that you've put into us. I love you. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to work here. Thank you for also being the best boss I could have. Um, you boys set the path for me, you've always made sure that I understand what I need to do and if I have any doubts or any questions, you've made sure to answer them as best as you can. I love, love, love that whatever I do in this journey, in my own fitness journey, in my journey to wanting to have an own gym, like to do all those types of things, I love that I still have your support and I will be able to come and see you whenever. Jersey did like the Super Bowl, man. It, then it big as the big as the what? Big as the what? Big as the what? Big as the Super Bowl, but the difference is it's just two guys playing that they did in the studio. Usually send they verses back to me and they be terrible, just like a two-year-old. I love a dinner with some fine women when they start debating about who the gold. I'm like, go ahead, say it then. Who the gold? Who the gold? Who the gold? Who the gold? Who you?